Welcome to Sizzle Chest in playing this awesome game that apparently has everybody in, you know, raving about it. So, with me as always is J Pad. We're going to be going through this game. Uh, just, low, low. just be just BSing and uh, having a good old time. Trying to at least. Mm -hmm. You know, we won't be playing. No. Last of Us 2. Why not? Because you don't got it. Oh, I can get it right now if I wanted to. <laughs> we would face the death. Alright, I'm ready. Hit me. Hit me. Hit you with what? Hit me with the stream. It won't let you watch this part, though. Hit me with your Japanese stream of justice. We are samurai. Oh. Oh. It's so beautiful. So I wonder if this is going to control like Way of the Samurai. Outsiders, send no your idea. finest warrior to face me. Mother. Y'all don't know what way the samurai is? Go check them games out. They're not very big. Like they're, I don't want to say open world-ish, but they kind of are. Um, but they're linear because uh, obviously it's PlayStation 2, um, you know, graphics and capabilities and whatnot. So there you go. Throw that wine on them. Dude is cold as ice. <laughs> Samurai! What's up? Do oh. you surrender? Hell no. Nah. Cowards <laughs> without honor deserve no mercy. No mercy! Oh snap. What? For real? You just gonna throw me in a game like that? I don't even know the buttons, fool. <laughs> oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty neat. I hope I was killing the right people. <laughs> hey. Oh, snap. No, I'm still waiting for my share play. Shit, for real? Is it, is it not showing? No, it's not. It's probably because it's uh, going through a cinematic thing. Oh, like cutscene? Yeah. I need you with me. Uh, you have to no. keep pushing, Lord Sakai. Even if it costs us our lives. As a command, Lord Shimura. Men, we must hunt down the Mongol leader. Everyone! I thought he me. was Mongolian. More Mongol dogs! Cut them down! Whoa! Oh, are you serious? You could like hack into people. Dude. Oh, my bad. Sorry. Dude, this is way better than Way of the Samurai. <laughs> it has like a better feel than Dynasty Warriors as well. Oh, 
Pretty dope. All right, what do these other buttons do? Nope. Ah, there's no like execution moves or nothing like that. I think there is. Dun 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 dun. Oh wow. Hey bro, still waiting for the share. Hang on, it's still going through cinematic stuff. It, oh like, gave, really still? Yeah, it gave me gameplay for a sec for a little bit and I was able to like take out some dudes, but I'm oh. waiting on the uh, cinematic thing to okay. finish. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, shoot enemy in the back. No honor. Oh, did you racist ass motherfucker? <laughs> That's not what he sound like. Oh, oh. pick another one. Shoot enemy in back twice. It's honor. Like, like, dude, don't be doing them like that. That's like, how are we supposed to harvest those organs? <laughs> yeah, it's like they got a bathtub full of ice just like off to the side. Huh. They had to go to Antarctica for that shit. <laughs> Whoa, this guy must be from Texas. See right. the size of that belt buckle? Yeah, bro. Woo. Either that or he's a backyard wrestling champ. I am Kota. Uh, <laughs> so Mongols are uh, the Texans of Asia? Because <laughs> 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 this guy's fucking huge. Brother. I bet you are warrior. he's like 120 pounds, like soaking uh, wet. It's just the armor makes him look huge. Uh -huh. <laughs> He's like five foot nothing. There's actually four guys inside the armor. They're like working <laughs> on arms and shit. <laughs> like, he's hey, a, giant robots in Japan, right? He's got Oompa Loompas. <laughs> While you were sharpening your sword, do you know how I prepared for today? I learned. Just I know your <laughs> there you go. Take your silence as a no. <laughs> Unless I wasn't paying attention to the screen, and I was supposed to <laughs> choose for him. <laughs> Man, I would have tried to stop him. Yeah. You know, sure. like if you're about to die anyway, then, you know. Yeah. You gotta try at least. You gotta try, you gotta keep on pushing. <laughs> <laughs> See that crap? Like they just throw me in the game and expect me to like know what the hell. No tutorial. Just ah. here you are. Really? That's none. None. I mean, they tell you when to push buttons, but they don't tell you, hey, you can push all these buttons and what these buttons oh, do. At least, at least not right now. So I'm just kind of like, what? Pause the game. Go to YouTube. <laughs> oh. There's a tutorial for that. Man, screw that. Just let me let me push the buttons already. Quit quit showing me the damn the movie of the game, and let me get them buttons. Like I understand you know story building and everything, but come right. on. 
people came here to see me fumble through this, this game. That's, that's the idea of this channel is to watch me fumble through this game. <laughs> I don't know how he took them arrows to the back and he was able to sit up like that with no problems. Like, I busted my hip up. Like, I pulled my hip and just rolling over in bed was like agonizing. Someone worked hard to keep me alive. So, he had arrows in him and he had armor and everything. Right. So, no weapons, just supplies. But the arrows were in his back. Right. But there's no damage to his back. Right. And he's still so able to like walk. A big bandage under there or something. It might be. I think that's what's hanging out from underneath his shirt. Mongols. Ooh. Where's the stub button at? Just stuck a bunch of flex tape on his back and sent him on his way. Uh-huh. <laughs> Japanese were the ones who invented <laughs> flex tape. That's a lot of damage. Wow. Ooh, look at that. Oh, shit. I lost the connection. Ooh. That's what you get for being half Jewish. <laughs> yeah. Let's try and reconnect if you can. Alright. Get down. This game kind of reminds me of, um, like, Someone was obviously when uh, you're playing a game that's based in Japan and you're kind of like in going back in time and whatnot or going to like an ancient uh, shrine or something or a temple. Um, mm -hmm. It all looks the same, but this game reminds me of uh, Fatal Frame. Oh, okay. You need to go lie down somewhere. So, yeah, I'm just like expecting a ghost to pop out and me to pull my camera out and make it, you know, to damage it. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you used to have that whole series? Yeah, but I got rid of it because. Um, I needed the money and reasons. <laughs> yeah. How are your wounds? Can you run? It's crazy though, dude, because like I got a hundred dollars per game. Where's my sword? That's good. Yeah. That's real good. Yeah, I sold it to a, a collector. He was like, dude, I've been looking for these forever. I was like, all right, man. Like a hundred bucks oh, a piece. Oh, yeah. He said, hell yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay. Boss says hi, and she right. says to tell your wife hi. All right. <laughs> I will when I uh, get a chance. Man, keep telling me you can't connect to the share play thing. Yeah, the internet's being kind of a dildo right now. Sorry, it's being a dick. <laughs> <laughs> it's, not, it's not being a fake dick, it's it being an actual dick. The internet's being a dick, Kitty's being a dildo. Oh shit. <laughs> That's right. Dude! Oh, I'm just gonna keep trying to get in though. Maybe. Maybe your mom's watching porn. <laughs> oh, that's how you do that. Shit, maybe. Uh, yeah. Well, that's what you get with friggin' cocks. Mm -hmm. I think in other places it's called like Time Warner or some shit, right? Right, yeah. Same company. There's nothing you can do for her. 
And I think the only real alternative mm -hmm. is CenturyLink. Oh, yeah. And that's not any better. <laughs> no, it's actually worse. Okay, well, it says a screen other than the game screen. So it's, I guess, technically co technically connected? Yeah, because, it's, again, it's another video thing. Oh, okay. Well, I'm not. Those little bouncing faces are not representative of my experience. I like his armor, dude. It's pretty dope. Yeah, starting armor. Still looks pretty dope. Like the detail, I'm, I'm saying. Ah. Uh, well, I heard that they did put special care into the detail, so. Mm -hmm. So far, I'm liking the way the game looks. Yeah, they say it's really beautiful. Like, even when you're just sitting still and watching things mm -hmm. the whole thing is like a work of art follow you unit to recover your sword do not raise the alarm so basically if I just follow her I won't sound the alarm I don't think so his voice is coming through just fine Dun, 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 dun. Squeeze through. Ooh, fire. Ooh, it reminds me of Outlast. If you haven't played Outlast, dude, that game is scary. Well, it's suspenseful. Because, you know, you gotta outlast your pursuers. <laughs> guy's like gives zero fucks he's like I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it whatever it is you're telling me not to do I'm gonna do I mean, I guess it's cool that, you know, she's taken him to go get what she stole from him, so that's cool, I guess. Like there was something for me to grab up there. Let me go ahead and grab that. All right, more supplies. I don't know what supplies is exactly. Maybe it's rice balls or I don't know, like bandages. It just says supplies. Okay. Okay. Really pretty looking game so far. Open it. Sweet.
find it. Can you find it? Oh, he found it. Yes. That's good news for me. Jin Sakai. Nephew to the great Lord Shimura. Lord Shimura. Your enemy is no match for you. But you still lack control. I was practicing. You lack discipline. Oh. Falls of hands. <laughs> Save lives. Uh yeah, so <clears throat> I don't know much how much you heard me talking about it before, but so this uh polymega. Oh yeah, polymega. Polymega. <clears throat> Okay, so I have a blurb right here in front of me, and it says that it supports Sega CD, TurboGrafx CD, Ooh. Neo Geo CD, mm. PlayStation, Sega Saturn, Saturn, and so I mentioned that it's modular, mm -hmm. so there's a base unit, and then you can get modules for it play additional stuff and you can also play with the modules you can play Super Nintendo cartridges Genesis Let's cartridges see. um yes I believe it's got a turbo graphic slot and it also supports uh, Sega 32x oh sweet uh, the modules are kind of pricey what are they running for um, about 80 bucks a piece. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's basically like you're buying a console per module. Yeah, yeah it's like you're buying buying a system, basically, like a retro system. Not bad. But you get access to the entire library. So if you've got, like, a Super Nintendo collection on your shelf, you can automatically just play them all. Shit. Honestly, the only cartridge game I have is Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. <laughs> oh, and Altered Really, Moonwalker? And Altered Beast. <clears throat> oh, okay. <clears throat> well, you know, they're collectible, so. Why not? Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah, but. Oh, so also, apparently, you can rip ROMs with the modules. Oh, sweet. And then save them to a hard drive. And that's right. <laughs> Rip, rips, rips, not reps. <laughs> Shred the red. <laughs> um, but so apparently Walmart is going to be selling this thing of all places. Fucking sweet. And I was talking to somebody else about it, and I was like. This sounds like a pirate's dream come true. This machine, like, like you know, uh, like Yar, yeah, our our Somalian pirates. Yar, rip some movies, matey. You know that kind of pirate. Okay. <laughs> not not booty pirates. Not the booty pirates. No. All right. Um, I don't know, man. That it sounds like kind of like a legal gray area. Mm -hmm. This thing, but. I think the base unit costs about 400 bucks. It's not too bad. I'd pay that. No. I mean, considering everything it can do, it's actually not bad. Um, yeah, I thought that was interesting. I'm, I'm interested, dude. You know, I might, uh, I might do a video on, on that when I get it. You know, show off the modules. <laughs> I have and, to... Dip into the kids' college fund. <laughs> oh, no, 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 not at all. Da Daddy needs content for the channel. <laughs> it's just an investment. Excellent uh. uh, I got girls. All they're supposed to do is get married and into a rich family, or a rich dude, you know what I'm saying? Oh, there you go. They don't need no college. Yeah, <laughs> and don't get exactly. 
<laughs> just give him enough hugs and kisses uh, to sustain him, and he'll just keep giving you the money. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Don't force me. Yeah, exactly. I'm just Don't force me to have to disappear a 16-year-old. Right. <laughs> because he couldn't keep his hands to himself. What the hell am I supposed to do? This guy want to still want to fight? Oh, she found your little black book. I have one last question. Oh, we're just doing commentary. The generation the share plays not working. I believe the bio code. No, it's all right. Super Two Sony. You have guys. an awesome idea, but <laughs> it's broken all the time. It's all right. Dude, again, like yeah, the clothing. The clothing in this game is like, like really good. I like it. Yeah, they really did their homework on it. Yeah. What does honor mean to you? I guess protecting people. Like there aren't that many new games coming out that I'm really interested in. Except, but except for Cyberpunk. That's one that that's one that I want. <laughs> yeah. It's a, is there a way, like, maybe somebody else knows, like, I, I could probably Google it, like, to send, like, gifts, you know, through the PlayStation Network, other than going to buy those damn gift cards? Uh, um, that's a good question. Uh, look that up right I, now. I, I don't know out. myself, personally. Find it out. All right, I'll look into it. Ooh, oh, I totally forgot. Flashback. Oh, snaps. It's about to go. D oh, that looks fucking sick. <laughs> oh, that's, fucking, that's so tight. I wouldn't mess with him. What you want, homie? So I hear there's like four different Ooh. disciplines to use. On uh, this? Yeah. Ooh, you got me. I hurt. Or I guess stances would be the proper term. Disciplines. Yeah, I guess. Like if you're uneducated, yeah, like, sure it's stances. So. You 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 could um, switch them up on the fly. Oh, there's a jump button. Yeah, I love it. Ah. You gonna die? <laughs> he does a jump kick. Yes. <laughs> Dude, I'm digging this game. All right, all I gotta say is everyone who's watching this, there's gonna be a lot more gameplay uh, of this um, in the coming weeks. There's gonna be a lot of uh, videos of this one. I don't think I'm gonna put this one down until it's done. <laughs> as far as episodes go, you know. I was watching gameplay and I thought, man, can you imagine the Wave of the Samurai was at that level? Like, those visuals plus Wave of the Samurai is like, choose your own adventure gameplay. Mm -hmm. I think that would be the perfect game. Yeah, Wave of the Samurai. Whoa. I still love that first game. Me too. Okay. I can, I can play that thing for days. Uh, the second game was okay, but it was a lot more, it was like they put time constraints on you. Yeah. Which really pissed me off because you had to like, you're always rush, rush, rush. Like you barely had time to decide what you wanted to do. You had to rush out there, try to get this little, you know, nugget of the story complete within the time limit. Or you just miss out on like another branching path or whatever. Yeah. And I, I've never even finished that game. Like really? not once have I ever finished it. No. Because I want to go everywhere. I want to see everything. I want to talk to everybody. And they're just like, no, boom, boom, boom. Do this, do this, do this. Yeah, that's right. It's, <clears throat> it's not, story-wise, it's not nearly as good as the first game. You know? Uh, 
Do you have yeah, all I've of them? never played any of the other ones beyond that, so. Yeah. So you had one and two, and then three, I right? have one and two. I don't have three. Oh, okay. I can probably find it for how you. Is, how is that, by the way? You played it? Yeah, it was, it was okay. That's what Would you compare it more to one or two? Two. Ah! <laughs> I mean, I'd still give it a shot, but mm -hmm. after I save my uncle. Yeah, I I aren't they up to like five or six now on those? Uh, I was about to say that. I think that they're up to about like five on them, but nobody's really paying attention. Yeah. Oh shit! Kind of a shame. Oh, I died. <laughs> Whoa. You were not worthy? Nope. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention and I ran out into a group of dudes and um, I was thinking about something else. And then before you know it, I'm, I got shanked. Should have been thinking about not dying. <laughs> Whoa. Let's get to the horse. <laughs> this dude's actually giving me a little bit of trouble, and uh, that chick, she took him down with the, her arrows. Oh, cool. Now we're about to Red Dead Summer Redemption horses. it up. If you we didn't take into battle. <laughs> <laughs> That's which horse? Let's see. I want this one because he looks like a Native American horse. That's what I should be riding. This dapple horse will be your entire. Oh, okay. Cool. Let's do it. Easy. Suits you. So, how did the horses work in that? I don't know. You just, is it kind of like GTA where you just find a horse parked somewhere and then you just grab it? Ooh, that noble. No, it was, um, he, or do uh, you actually like own a horse? There's, there's three horses here and you get to choose between the three and whichever one you choose is, is yours for the game. Oh, I see. Yeah. Komodo dog. Yeah. Got me a little bit of a trophy there. So, I like the way the controls are like, so far in this game. The uh, They're pretty easy. Um, and honestly, it feels kind of like a Ninja Gaiden game. Um, just okay. less fast paced. Right. <laughs> and I, no wall running and shit like that. Yeah. Trust me, the Ninja Gaiden games were so difficult. Yeah. I, I, oh, I know. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I wanted to break my controllers, my TV, my face, everything, dude. Like, <laughs> I tried pulling my hair out so many times playing that game. Nah, just watch the cinematic movie on YouTube and call it good. <laughs> yeah. It's spare oh. your controller. Yeah. I mean, I can take some pretty decent physical damage, so I'd rather just do that. Just punch myself. I don't know. <laughs> 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 Maybe, dude, I should probably get one of those, like, Wing Chun uh, practice dummies. Or, oh, shoot. <laughs> or a punching bag, so anytime I play an infuriating game like that, I'll just, like, you know, take it out. On Set that. it up next to the couch. Yep. <laughs> so you feel that urge, you can just get up and <laughs> Cobra Kai the shit. Oh, okay. Let's see if this will work. I've come for Lord Shimura. Dude, there's like a standoff mode. It's almost like a kind of right, like a duel. Go. Yeah. And it's like just before they strike, I have to. Oh yes. Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> I bet you that's like Bushido Blade where one hit kills you. Yeah. Dude. I'm gonna have to buy you this game for Christmas. <laughs> Accepted. <laughs> this game is awesome. Oh, look. Listen, I mean, I just ended some suffering. Yay! Not sure. Oh, I gotta go save beach. Uncle. Uncle! Uncle Roger! Yes, I, I subscribed to Uncle Roger, folks. 
He's freaking hilarious. <laughs> he actually helped my wife learn how to make fried rice really good. <laughs> Whoa, what is going on with his stick? That was cool. I like fried rice. I to whip up a batch. Heck yeah, I will. Well, I'll have her whip some up when I come over there to help you out with some uh, wire work. Yeah. Whoa, sweet. Dude, this chick is very helpful. Like, I'm surprised. Like, usually the AI is, like, stupid. Is that anything like, uh, I don't know, like Far Cry 5 where you can hire people as, like, sidekicks? No, this chick is just helping me. Or or she's just there. She's uh like one of the villagers, I guess. Or the, or oh, the okay. village that uh that I'm helping folks out in. Liberating. Yeah. So she's basically rising Whoa. up. What was that? Oh, it's like a hail of freaking fiery arrows. That was cool. Did you take one to the knee? Nah, I uh, I took one to the chest though. I can't keep going. <laughs> Dude, his so like I love that the swords don't make that cheesy clangy sound, you know, when they hit. If I'm not back soon. Right. And his sword actually sounds. Like it's supposed to sound when you pull it out of the sheath and when you um, actually like put it back in. It doesn't go zing. Yep. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. <gasps> oh no. I hit the uh, heal button a little bit too late and I died again. Oh. It's all right. Okay, there's a second attack he does right there. Gonna have to keep your coke mirror handy for those little bursts of much needed life energy. Oh yeah. <laughs> Just snort a quick line <laughs> and chop your way through these fools. Oh, okay. You're doing it again, dummy. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, uh, don't don't forget also there's that co-op DLC that they got. Oh yeah. For this, uh, Legends, I think it's called. I think it's already. I already downloaded it. Oh, did you? Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. Yes. Hmm. I wonder what's over here. Uh, it looks like if I go that way, I might not be able to come back, or I'll die. <sighs> oh well, let's, let's try it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I died. Right. It, it kills you. <laughs> Why not? Hey, man, I, I, you never know until you hey, try, right? That's right. I was just about to say, never know. <laughs> Oh guys, that's funny. Petey Wheat Straw. I don't know. I don't know why I remember that. Petey Wheat Straw. So, did you manage to pet any foxes yet? No. Apparently, there's a bunch of foxes in the game that you can pet. And then he'll do like. He does something. Maybe he eats them? No, he doesn't eat them. Why not? I don't know. Well, how do you heal in that game anyway? You have like healing supplies and you hit down on the. Oh, okay. The D-pad. So it's kind of like Horizon Zero Dawn. Yeah, I love like that game. Like fill up a satchel. Oh my god. Stuff. 
Oh, dude. I had to platinum it. Oh, dude. It's such a good game. So, I was... I was reading an article there it is. about the sequel. Yeah. Right? Uh-huh. So, it's definitely coming to PS5. Yeah. And the girl that voiced Aloy. Uh huh. She says that the sequel is mind blowing. Like, if you, if you loved the first game, she said the sequel is mind blowing. That was the word she used. It's probably mind blowing so, to her because she never played a I, video game. <laughs> she, she was blown away by Quasi Cupcakes. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, backwards W. Oh. That was tight. I'm digging his game. Stand up. Who wants some of this? Yeah, Doing the stream on Ghost of Tsushima. Here we go. Oh, oh. And then we're going to do something. I love it. I love it. So, have you watched The Mandalorian yet? Yeah. What did you think? I liked it. It was good. It was good, right? Yeah, I like it a lot. Dude, he just slit my throat all brutal, man. That was awesome. <laughs> what did you think about that moment when he took his helmet off? Um, I was kind of like, cool, but why let me, why you ready to see his face? Yeah, I thought it was too soon. Yeah, yeah, dude, for real. I was like, hold on, man. They could have done that in season two. Or at the end of the series? I think, <laughs> I think, well, yeah, or that. I think that Whoa. instead of showing his face, they should have showed IG starting to pull his helmet off. Mm -hmm. And then we see IG from his point of view. Right. So like, oh, fake out. We're, you thought we were going to show you, but. Yeah. I, it was like. I think that would have just been a better angle to go with it. It's like. Yeah, the, but whatever, you know. Yeah. This I seen it, so. Well, I already knew what he like looked it. like, so. I didn't, I didn't. It was like ripping off a fun band-aid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a fun bloody band-aid. Oh shit! I didn't realize that he was there. I also think. That that's the most blood they've shown in a Star Wars production since Episode Four. Oh yeah, when he chopped off dude's arm, or that thing's arm. Yeah, when he chopped off the guy's arm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Because I know Luke, Luke gets a little beat up in Empire, but it wasn't anywhere near that. Well, remember and then when he gets his hand cut off, yeah. there was like zero blood at all. Right, but remember Luke also chopped off that creature's arm in Empire. Yes, yep. well that was mostly not very bloody. Yeah, especially considering the size of that thing. But there was a, a there was a little bit of blood. Geyser blood. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it it should have gave Guar a run for their money. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I will show him his nephew, broken and humiliated, begging to join the Mongol Empire. Because. Oh yeah. Well, that's the that's the prevailing theory. This is your time, Lord Sakai. Uh oh. Let's see what happens. I guess happened. they didn't think about that and. Star Wars. 
take it, 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 Oh my gosh, I, I have to fight freaking Kotan Khan or whatever the hell his name is. Your uncle is watching. Is Stab him in the dick. He doesn't have a dick. Oh. Stab him in the butt. Submit, You submit. I was no match. He annihilated me. No. Uh oh. Yeah. Surrender. Have to be more crafty than that. I will never surrender. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he sounded like he said. Like surrender. I was like what? <laughs> English motherfucker, do you speak it? <laughs> Ooh. Well, they don't speak Mongol, that's for sure. Nope. Oh, dude. Dude just got thrown off a freaking cliff. My dude did. Whatever the hell this guy's name is. I wasn't uh -oh. paying attention. His name's like Sakurai or something like that. Sakai. Surprise! I have paper wings. <laughs> uh. You gl you float safely to the ground. No, it's froat. It's froat. <laughs> oh, froat. I froat safely. Oh, dude. Froat safely. Safely. Froat safely. <laughs> it's chicken fried rice, you son of a bitch. <laughs> it's fried rice, you plick. <laughs> 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 Still, still a great scene. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. I'm exiting out to the title screen. All right. That is gonna do it for this playthrough of Ghost of Tsushima. Su yeah. Sushi. Tsushima. So. Ghost of uh, Dead Fish. Tune in next week. It's like every Monday is RPG uh, Monday. Uh, yes. Tuesdays is action slash horror games. And Friday will be FPS Friday. And then Saturdays Woo! we have the casual casual game. Like uh, I'll probably play Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Uh, maybe Jay and I will You'll watch That's us right. beat the shit out of each other in Samurai Showdown or yeah. Socks and sandals allowed. Yep. Uh, what else? We'll probably play a beat 'em up. Maybe some Streets of Rage Four, uh, 99 Vita, something like that. Uh, but yeah, we'll do a live you stream never know. so we can interact with everyone else and just have fun every Saturday around. Uh, I would say Saturday evening. Um, you guys should be in, especially with folks who are afraid of COVID staying in the house. So. I ain't scared. Cowards! <laughs> exactly. I was going to say, I'm not scared. <laughs> Jesus protect me. So, <laughs> I, don't yes. need, I don't need no stinking mask. <laughs> <laughs> Lard ass. Yeah. Uh, but anyways. Oh, you, that's hard hat. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, you know, uh, continue on this journey with us. We just want to have fun and just Say some geeky stuff and just be stupid, you know? That's what it's all about. Alright? Oh. So. It's a Tuesday for me. <laughs> Alright, everyone. Take it easy. Alright. See ya.